Ladies and gentlemen, the story you are about to see is true. The names have been changed to protect the innocent. We need to ask you a few questions. Oh, okay. Oh, it's gonna have to wait. The movie's starting. Traffic seems less ridiculous than normal. Is he drunk? I think Friday is drunk. It's Friday, Friday. Okay, that was your one time using that joke tonight. What do you say to a man with a bomb? Why do you have a bomb? Quick, Frank, let me see that cup of coffee. <laughs> this is gonna be hilarious. It's pretty narrow, Joe. There was dynamite inside, there was dynamite in Connie's room. Even had dynamite shoved up his nuts. I was going to say water eater. I'm just trying to figure out what I'm still doing here. Joe, should we be smoking near a bomb? I'll make you a bet, Connie. As long as it has nothing to do with the Cubs, I'm in. Hey, cop. Your fly is down. I'm good going. I can operate an elevator. Jackass. So their plan is to grab the bomb from him and punch him in the face. Wow. Great plan. Wait a minute. You guys are the cops from the show we're watching. That's about the size of it. If anything went wrong and Connie got out of position, the plan would fail. If Chief Erickson didn't estimate the force of the wind correctly, the plan would fail. If everything went as planned, the plan would fail. Pull the mayor up? What? Why are they hanging the mayor? This is the worst plan ever. Excuse me, sir? I don't know anything. I, I have a garden. I got it! I got it! I got it! I got it! I don't got it. You know, now that I think about it, it's, it's right. What are you still doing here? We've been partners. A long time. A long time, sure. And you still haven't noticed, have you? Notice what? Earmites, Joe. Earmites.